I've done long distance things before, Transcon twice, but it's a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I wanted to set up something that put a lot of emphasis on riding with skill and panache and also something for younger riders to come come into. This is like our first race as a team, Team Techers, and if we can get through this, we're gonna get through anything. My name's Alec Briggs, and my strokes are riding an hour and not 25 hours. It's 25 hours amongst four of you, and like, I, I rarely race over an hour. I rarely ride my bike over three hours. So if they then go and race like six, seven hours each, that's like totally different. Then. The Red Bull time lapse is obviously over 25 hours, and how hour is quite important, so we want to get the strongest guy in for that as well. Oh, brutal. They're racing that man. Like they're just on it. There's no respite. Coming into it, I thought it would just be a lot of riding on your on your own, but found that actually groups are forming and put a lot of work in. And it's actually like riding in a little break. Those last two laps, we were full gas. What I enjoy about riding my bike is just you almost build a relationship with someone without talking to them. You just get in this little group, you give each other the nods, and you just kind of push each other through, and then you go your separate ways, never to see them again. I mean, you could, you could pass them the street and not have a clue who they were. Oh, solid, man. Ooh. So it's either 2 a.m. or 1 a.m. now. I still can't get my head around it. I'm sure I've been told like three times. Because I went from one to just before two, didn't I? Yeah. And so that was just a complete waste of time, theoretically. <laughs> <laughs> power hour laps count for double. Do a lap quicker than they do, or someone on the same lap. You still have to do the power hour, aren't you? Power yeah. hour and maybe some extra. Riding in the dark, right, everything seems faster. Got to think that pushing and just kind of mentally stay awake and hope that you can find a good group of solid riders that you can kind of work with just to make it a bit easy for you. Oh, Keep these gaps tight. People leaving gaps. Come on, boys. Oh, Hard work. He said he was like seeing spots and he was looking at his Garmin screen and it was just like flickering at him. That's how hard this thing is, man. People like riding around, just like seeing ghosts and stuff. So I think I'm pushing um, five hours now, so we must be well over 100 miles at least. Get on that group, I'm like, it was like full on, flat out, full stick for the last like two thirds of a lap. Time lap's the hardest thing I've ever done, man. 25 hours though, man. It just cracks you, man. It just cracks you so hard. Three strong boys now to finish. Hopefully we can maintain second place. We've been racing for 25 hours and we are neck and neck for second. I just didn't think that would happen. It's pretty cool. I reckon I've ridden my bike for three hours in the last two months. Happy I'm just alive. <laughs> I've probably done about 2.30ish K. It's been fast. Glad it's over. I'm very glad it's over. What well up, man? Can we never do that again? <laughs> we can never do that again. Team Techers, 138 laps. I'm going to take great pride in when someone goes, do you want to do a 24 hour race with me? Go, it's not 25, mate.